بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ٹوڈیز ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس دیٹ ہاؤ ٹو ڈیل ود ٹیکس ان وائزیز ایشوڈ پرائر اینڈ پوسٹ ٹو ویٹ ریٹ انکریز ٹو ففٹین پرسینٹ دا فرسٹ تھنگ وچ وی نیڈ ٹو ریمبر از دا ڈیٹس دا امپارٹنٹ کلاسیفیکیشنز افیکٹیو ڈیٹ آف ویٹ ریٹ انکریز ٹو ففٹین پرسینٹ آن فرسٹ جولائی ٹوینٹی ٹوینٹی Announcement date was 11 May 2020 and the end date of the invoices will be 30th June 2020. Before we start this lecture, kindly subscribe our channel to press the bell icon so you can receive our latest video notification. Tax invoices issued before 11 May 2020. If the invoice has been issued before 11 May, and the supply in relation to that invoice has been done on or after 1 July, a 5% VAT rate will be applicable on that supply, provided that the actual supply is done before the end of 30th June 2021. For example, a car has been bought in March 2020 with the value of 80,000 plus 4,000 percent VAT An invoice has been issued on the same date with the full value with the condition that the car will be delivered on August 2020. A 5% rate will be applicable to that supply as the invoice has been issued before 11 May. If a tax invoice issued prior to 11 May and concerned supply occurred on or after 1 July. A 5% VAT applies to the supplies given that the concerned supply completed prior to the end of 30th June 2021. For instance, on 15th April 2020, a maintenance company signed a five years home maintenance contract with a customer. An invoice has been issued on the contract date with the full amount of the contract plus 5% VAT. So, If an invoice has been issued in the contract date with the full value of the supply plus 5% VAT, the value of the services provided to the customer from 15th April to 30th June will be subject to 5% VAT. And any services provided starting from 1st July 2021 will be subject to 15% VAT and the supplier should issue an invoice with the tax difference. Periodic tax invoices issued for continuous supplies. If a tax invoice issued for a continuous supplies partially executed before and on or after 1st of July, a 5% VAT rate will be applicable to the invoice related to the part executed before 1st July and a 15% VAT rate will be applicable to the invoice related to the part executed on or after 1st July. For example, on 1st May 2020, an individual signed a health care insurance policy with a health insurance company. Based on the agreement, the customer will pay the due amount on a monthly basis and a separate monthly invoice will be issued for the monthly insurance services provided. The insurance services provided to the customer during the period of 11 May to 30th June will be subject to 5% VAT and the starting from 1st July, the insurance services provided will be subject to 15% and all invoices related to the services rendered starting from 1st July 2020 should include new VAT rate of 15%. Tax invoices issued from 11 May to 30th June. If a tax invoice has been issued from 11 May to 30th June, the applicable VAT rate will be 5% if the actual supply has been provided before the end of 30th June 2020. And VAT rate of 15% will be applicable if the actual supply provided on or after 1st July. For example, on 20 May 2020, a tablet has been purchased for 
3000 plus SAR 150 5% VAT. A tax invoice has been issued on the same date and the tablet will be delivered to the customer on 15th June 2020. The transaction will be subject to 5% VAT rate as the supply, the tablet delivery occurred before 1 July. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to receive our latest video. Thank you very much and goodbye.